what is up everybody it is your boy super sand cab and i'm here with another build video this build video i'm going to break down everything i'm going to break down the myth between behind the soft cap for real this time guys and show that there really isn't one that was my mistake last time but this time i'm going to show that there really is no soft cap for basic attack i'm going to show the build with limitation and without limitation because this build works both ways but there is a little bit of a difference so guys do not do anything until i get to the point in the video where i say now i'm going to show you guys the build for both sides so ignore basically everything that you see just listen to what I'm saying with the basic ignore the 17 that you're gonna see on key that's the one thing that I'm telling you just ignore that for now until I get into the actual build part but first we're gonna break down the soft cap basic myth that is around this community it is not there for sands I'm telling you guys so we're gonna start on 27 then we're gonna go to 76 and then 125 because that is a plus 49 boost in between each and then we're going to calculate the differences to see if that soft cap is really there and if there's a difference in how much damage you actually gain so that combo does 390 61 damage this combo does 3191 damage now I'm going to go over to my um, without limitation build that's the one with the QQ bang on I do this naked because this is basically how you fight with limitation you have no QQ bang no super soul so that's why I do that so this part naked and now we're gonna get into the without limitation part where the QQ bang is active and then I will show my QQ bang and super soul after I break down the soft cap myth as well so now that does 4197 damage and then this does 3381 damage so now we're gonna raise our basic attack to 76 and we're gonna see the difference between um, 27 to 76 and then we're gonna raise it to 125 and see the difference and if the differences are similar or basically the same then obviously there is no soft cap but if there are major differences then there is but I'm telling you guys you're gonna see that there is basically no difference so now let's raise it to 76 and see what the gain is and first we're gonna do it naked again basically so you have no QQ bang active no super soul or anything like that and your basic is just on 76 so now let's get into it with that and let's see what the gain in the the plusage to your damage is with both of those combos and yes that's a the Gogeta has that kind of hair when he's naked so you know but let's see what the damage is right here 4191 and then the second combo does 3378 so that's a gain of 230 and for the first combo and 187 for the second combo so if the when you plus it to 125 if it does basically the same thing then again the the myth is it's busted it is not real I'm proving that to you guys today so now let's show what the damage is with 76 basic attack with your QQ bang active for those without limitation let's get into that and see the differences in that category as well all right now let's see what the damage on the first combo is 4430 second combo does 3571 so the first one had a gain of 233 the second one had a gain of 190 so now let's raise it to 125 and then see what the, the differences are and again if the differences are the same which they will be then the soft cap basic attack for sans myth is busted it is not real guys I'm here to prove that to you today again because I apologize for that last video I listened to all these websites and all these forums like a dummy I, I shouldn't have listened to them nobody should listen to these websites and I'm here to prove that it is not real and a subscriber of mine did message me about this um sorry bro I couldn't find the messages but you know who you are let me know down below in the comments shout out to you man thank you thank you for letting me know about this so now let's test it with one at 125 with uh, this is for people with limitations basically naked no QQ bang or anything active right now let's see what the damage is 4427 and the second combo does 
3,569. So that's a gain of 236 and 191. So really, your damage actually went up right there. The damage increase actually went up by 6 and by 4 for both of those combos. That right there shows you guys that the that myth is busted. It is not real, and now I'm going to show it with the QQ Bang active to show that it is it is completely not real no matter what you are what you have on whether you have your QQ bang on or whether you have nothing on so now let's show it with the QQ bang active at 125 basic and see the differences on this side now the first combo does 4662 damage second combo does 3759 damage that is a gain of 232 and 188 so the gains are exactly the same basically guys um, this right here again this bust that soft cap basic myth so that myth is not real I apologize again for that last build video guys please forgive me for that but now let's get in to the actual build and why I had that 17 key on there that is for people without limitations people who wanted to have this build with limitations do not worry about that 17 key but for those who do know have been with my channel basically we're going back to that original build that Gogeta had from the start 125 basic guys 125 stamina excuse me and then I believe it's gonna be 95 key blast supers for those or strike supers for those who play with limitations because you don't want nothing on key and then once 17 plus 76 is 93 and I believe once you get to 85 I'm at 84 on Gogeta right now and I believe 85 is another two points so that would bring your key blast supers to 95 or your strike supers to 95 in total make sure you base your key blast super or strike super where you put those points off what you do I'm a key blast super so I'm gonna put it on key blast now let's get into with why I have that 17 key there for those without limitations it's because the super soul that I have guys the super soul that I have is Kaba's super soul um, it gives you an XL boost to melee damage and a medium boost to strike super damage when you transform into a super sand now again I'm not a strike player I'm a key blast player so I'm just gonna put the key blast super there if you're a strike player you're gonna get a major boost to basic attack and a medium boost to strike super when you transform with this super soul without limitations so now also I'm gonna show you guys my QQ bang and why I only need 17 key because you want to use super saiyan regular super saiyan so you go super saiyan 3 and get that 30% damage boost because that is the biggest boost you get from any transformation and you have to transform using super saiyan for Kaba super soul to work so you need to have 17 key if you have a QQ bang like mine I'm gonna show you my QQ bang again and show you why I need 17 key and break down how I figured out how I needed 17 key if you have a different type of QQ bang now let's get into the QQ bang and my skill set and all that as well and my super soul as well and read that uh, show you guys okay as you see right here I have I'll make you regret that Kaba super soul you get it from the bonus parallel quest that you get from the DLC now as you see super saiyan mode boost normal attacks XL boost melee attacks which is strike supers medium I'm telling you guys that boost is absolutely insane especially if you have a QQ bang like mine as you see my QQ bang is actually extremely good I do not remember the recipe guys I apologize for that but I have a plus five to health minus one to key plus five to stamina plus five to basic minus five to key and strike super now how I figured out that I needed 17 key is what I did is that when I reset my character I put on the QQ bang and I kept loading in and out until and I kept raising my key until I got to exactly five bars and that's how I knew that I needed that much key now this is the skill set that I have I have Kaioken Kamehameha, Dai Dai Missile Barrage, Gallic Beam Cannon um, Maximum Charge, Times 4 Kam Kaioken Kamehameha and Final Kamehameha now I'm going to show you guys how much damage this does in the training mode once you transform to Super Saiyan 3 with this build with a QQ bang like this and with this Super Soul on so let's get into that Alright, so now let's show the difference in damage when you use this Super Soul and go Super Saiyan 3. Now, also after this, guys, I'm going to show one match with limitation for those 
in rank with limitation for those who want to see uh, the build with limitation I'm going to show one in rank without limitations for those who want to see the super soul and QQ bang in effect now it was 4662 before transformation after transformation it's 6537 that is a 40% increase in your basic attack damage regularly regular super saiyan without regular super saiyan 3 without this super soul does a 30% increase in damage this with this super soul active guys you get a 40% increase in damage look at all that damage done by that one combo and remember I have a QQ bang that minuses from my key blast supers so if you use strike supers this transformation also gives you a medium boost in strike supers making your strike supers that much stronger and also with the QQ bang I have you see as why I can have zero health without limitation and still have a good amount of health I have over two bars of health I have 10 bars of stamina, 5 bars of key, strong as hell basic, and good key blast super. And if you want to go strike super, you will have a strong as hell strike super as well. So now I'm going to get into the rank matches that I did. First one is with limitation. So I'll see you guys over there. Alright, let's get these matches in. Come on, AGNT. AGN, oh, you're gonna sit there. You one of those want to sit there for the block, huh? No, come here. Okay, give me that. Key. Well, I really, this is with limitations. I don't need key. I'm not gonna transform. Remember, guys, with limitations, I do not recommend transforming. You don't get a, as major boost from the super saw as you would without limitations. And again, most of the time, when you do transform, you're giving up a combo opportunity or you're giving your opponent a chance to break you. So it's really not that good. But in without limitations, I'm gonna show you when the best time to transform is so you guys cannot get stamina broken or anything like that let's get into oh no 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 see that's just no, 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 you just you just don't do that no that's just a mistake come get this wow okay game you just want to fire it the wrong way you just okay thank you i appreciate that come here use that stamina oh your stamina is gone again come here goodbye say sayonara to that stamina Oh, you got me with the back hit. Okay. Oh, you got me again. I don't appreciate that. I ain't think. No, 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 no. You don't get to do that. Now this match is over. Come here. Come here. Get your ass up in there. Goodbye. And times four. I'll see you later. Good match, but that is the build with limitations. Now let's get into it. Okay, now let's show the full power of this build without limitations. Get that 40% boost in damage. Come here. No, sir. I don't think so. Ill, the Illmatic J. I appreciate that key, though. I need it to when I can transforms. And again, I'm gonna show you guys when a good time to use your transformation after what certain type of combo. When a good time to use it, so you won't get stamina broken no matter what. No, you're not gonna hit me. Oh, I thought that. I thought. I thought I landed my hits there. I thought I landed my kicks. Come on now. Come here, Illmatic J. Oh, this is a lot of clashes though, isn't it? I just love clashes. Oh, I just I just love clashes. Clashes are something. That's something that, again, I will always say they need to fix. Oh, what the fuck? That stopped it? I didn't know that could do that. Okay, I just wasted some stamina. Oh, well. No biggie. No, you don't touch me. Come here. No, you don't touch. Come here. Oh, whoa, whoa. Oh, man. I used the back hit and everything just because. Come me. Oh, come on. With the, I need the stamina break. I don't need that. No, no, you don't touch me. I told you that. You don't do it, bro. You, no, I, why, why are you touching me? I don't appreciate that. But now, since his stamina is, I'm going to, like, as, see as I kicked him away like that, his stamina would have covered and he could have snap vanished or Z vanished out at the top of that combo. But if you can finish off that combo without them being able to stamina vanish out of it, finish off that combo. But if you can't, when you kick him away like that, transform. But now, let's get the serious damage boost coming here. What are you doing? What is that? And how the hell did you hit me? You were like five feet away from me. Okay, I see the connection issues. Come here. Thank you. Come here. No, you don't run away. Look at the massive damage. Every punch. Every punch is just. Oh, look at that. Oh, come on. Thank you, connection. But do you see the massive damage that every punch is just dealing, guys? This build is absolutely insane. You have an insane amount of stamina, a good amount of health, a decent enough amount of key for without limitation, guys. This build is absolutely insane. I'm telling you, I absolutely love how much damage I deal with this build. It's crazy. Thank you guys for watching. Um, 
I appreciate the support so much, guys. This is the best build video possible for a Sans. As far as my knowledge goes, I'm telling you, this is the best build you can put out for a Sans right now with or without limitations. Now, with limitations, remember, you don't put that 17 on key. You put that 17 on your key blast supers or your strike supers, whichever way you decide to go, whether it be strike or key blast supers. The soft cap is not real. Again, I apologize for that, guys. But if you're doing without limitations, you're going to need some key so you can get your be able to transform to Super Saiyan 3. Now, again, if you don't have a QQ bang like mine, just keep going in and out, testing it and seeing how much key you need until you get to that point of five bars. And then you'll know, like, from if you have a QQ bang that gives a minus two to key, keep going in and out until, like, say, rise it to like 25. If 25 key is still not enough with a minus 2, rise it to like 30. If 30 is not enough, then rise it to like 32 because at that point you should be right there. And just keep rising in small increments until you get to the point of 5 bars of key so you can be able to transform to Super Saiyan 3. And then after that, again, put the rest of your stats on either Strike or Key Blast Supers, whichever way you want to go. If you do go Strike Supers, remember you get a medium boost as well from the super from Kaba Super Soul which Kaba Super Soul is honestly OP again guys so thank you for watching I hope this video helped you guys out and I I, I know it exposed that myth about the basic soft cap so have a good Christmas guys peace